Good match, Van Gogh. Yeah, great Thanks. job out there. It means a lot coming from Orlando, you. Orlando, here I come. I'm gonna get a condo on the beach. There's no beach in Orlando. Well, then I'll make sure to furnish my condo with wall-to-wall -wall sand. Before you start making big plans, we have a few things to discuss. Like what? My start date? Future opponents? Waste measurements for the NXT title? Not exactly. To be honest, I'm not a fan of your Mr. CQ character. You need to come up with something different. It's not really a character, but fine. I can come up with something different after I get to NXT. Full disclosure, I don't think you'll be heading to NXT. Not anytime soon, at least. You're just not ready. I was actually more impressed with your opponent over here. Wait, what? So I've decided to offer him an opportunity instead. You'll have a tryout match in an up-and-coming WWE event. Really? Yes. I've been doing this a while now, and I know talent when I see This is some I kind of it. joke. Because you were supposed to be here to scout me and not him. Plans change all the time in this business. That's a good lesson for you to learn. I have to go catch my flight. You and Baron will be hearing from us soon with the details on your tryout match. Don't make me regret my decision. I won't. Thank you. Unbelievable. I told you not to ruin this for me, and look what happened. Whoa, all I did was give it everything I had out there, okay? I can't help it that he saw more potential in me. Potential? Or was it your boy Baron here putting you over with him? I always knew that he was your favorite, but I didn't think it would cost me a shot at WWE. This was all Matt Bloom's decision. Do you think I want to see my top guys leave? <laughs> and do you think we want to stay here forever, wrestling in front of a few hundred people for crap money? That's not what I meant. I'm just saying we're building something good here. Besides, if you left, who would design our title belts? I only make your belts because you pay us so little for wrestling. It's so bad teacher's pet over here has to live in his van. I thought that was a joke. I only live in it when times are tough, which is most of the time. Well, that nickname's not as much fun anymore. Look, you just need to trust the process. We're building a brand. And think of it this way. If any of us make it to WWE, it'll be good for everyone. It'll help put BCW on the map and lead to more opportunities. Oh, yeah. Easy for you to say. You're the one with a WWE tryout match. He's right, though. What's the saying? A rising boat will lift all tides? I think it's the other way around. Whatever. Come on, let's drop this thing and bring it in for a BCW handshake. Yeah, no thanks. I'll let you two celebrate alone. Don't worry about him. And congrats! I am truly happy for you! This is way bigger than the high school gym, and the VFW, and the state fair, combined. Don't let that bother you. All that matters is the rings the same size. All right, good point, but I assume their rings aren't covered in rust and mysterious stains. Hey, we're working on fixing that. Come on, let's go meet Triple H and uh, try to play it cool. You don't want to recite his entire career history like you did with Matt Bloom. <laughs> <sighs> it wasn't his entire career history. Hey, Hunter, it's been a while. This is my guy that Matt Bloom wanted to bring in for the tryout match tonight. Nice to meet you. You trained him, Baron? I did. He's one of my top students. I'll try not to hold that against him. Look, I've heard a lot of good things. But I want to see you in action tonight before we decide anything. Do you have an opponent for him yet? I do. Surviving in WWE is all about how you handle adversity. So you're going to face the toughest guy we have. Actually, the toughest 
monster we have. Go introduce yourself to Braun. Don't worry. He won't hurt you. Not until your match, at least. Uh, hey, Braun? I, I just wanted to introduce myself. No autographs. I'm, I'm not a fan. I'm actually your opponent tonight. You mean victim? So how do you want to die tonight? Uh, I'd like to survive tonight, if that's okay with you. What I meant was, in what type of match do you want to get these hands? I want a regular match. That way I can show Triple H that I can put up a fight inside the ring without having to rely on any kind of weapon. I can't believe you thought I was actually going to let you choose the type of match tonight. We're gonna do what I wanna do because I'm the monster among men. So it'll be a steel cage match. That way you can't run from me. A steel cage, great idea. It's gonna be my second choice. Just make the most of your opportunity, win or lose. Matt Bloom brought you in here because he saw something in you. Just go out there and show him that again. Oh, and try to get some free swag. I'd like a Bootio's lunchbox if you're taking requests. What, like a replica title belt? Of course, just trying to keep the mood light. But if you do see a lunchbox lying around, hey, I've seen some of your indie stuff online. Not bad. I've seen what he's capable of when he was my partner in the mixed match challenge. Based on that, I suggest you start running now. Massachusetts, weighing in at 225 pounds, Ace Aiden.
This guy, he looks like deer in the headlights. No, 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 that's the look of someone whose life is flashing before their eyes. What are the odds this guy can pull off the upset over Braun? One in a billion, one in a trillion? Yeah, uh, so, so you're telling me there's a chance? Should we even bother to learn this guy's name? <laughs> I'll just stick to his initials. D-O-A. I heard this is actually this guy's tryout match tonight. What you try it out for? To be a crash test dummy? Have you seen some of this guy's matches on the indies? He's actually pretty good. No, I've got better things to do, like watching puddles evaporate or reading the phone book. Wait, wait, you still have a phone book? Yeah, remind me to hit you with it on SmackDown tomorrow. Do you guys remember Baron Blade? Apparently he trained this guy. Yeah, I can tell. This guy pulled up in the parking lot today, and he was driving a bug exterminator van. Well, that's appropriate because he's about to get squashed by Braun Strowman. One, two. Have you seen some of this guy's matches on the indies? He's actually pretty good. No, I've got better things to do, like watching puddles evaporate or reading the phone book. Wait, wait, you still have a phone book? Yeah, remind me to hit you with it on SmackDown tomorrow. What are the odds this guy can pull off the upset over Braun? One in a billion, one in a trillion? Yeah, uh, so, so you're telling me there's a chance? This guy, he looks like deer in the headlights. No, 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 that's the look of someone whose life is flashing before their eyes. I heard this is actually this guy's tryout match tonight. What's he trying out for? To be a crash test dummy? Remember Baron Blade? Apparently he trained this guy. Yeah, I can tell. I saw this guy pull up in the parking lot today, and he was driving a bug exterminator van. Well, that's appropriate because he's about to get squashed by Braun Strowman. Do we even bother to learn this guy's name? <laughs> I'll just stick to his initials. D-O-A.
I heard this is actually this guy's tryout match tonight. What's he trying out for? To be a crash test dummy? Remember Baron Blade? Apparently he trained this guy. Yeah, I can tell. Look at this guy. He looks like deer in the headlights. No, 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 no. That's the look of someone whose life is flashing before their eyes. This guy pulled up in the parking lot today, and he was driving a bug exterminator van. Well, that's appropriate because he's about to get squashed by Braun Strowman. What are the odds this guy can pull off the upset over Braun? One in a billion? One in a trillion? Yeah, so, so you're telling me there's a chance. bother to learn this guy's name? <laughs> I'll just stick to his initials. D-O-A. Have you seen some of this guy's matches on the indies? He's actually pretty good. No, I've got better things to do, like watching puddles evaporate or reading the phone book. Wait, wait, you still have a phone book? Yeah, remind me to hit you with it on SmackDown tomorrow. You did a good job out there. Really? Feels like I got run over by a big bearded tank. Think it was enough for him to sign me? I don't know. But no matter what, you always have a home in the BCW. Thanks. Hey, I saw a lot of positive things from you tonight. Most importantly, you didn't seem intimidated by being on the bigger stage or by being locked in the cage with a monster. So with that being said, we'd like to offer you an NXT contract. Look that over and return it at tomorrow night's show. This is amazing, thank you. I would shake your hand, but I think three of my fingers are dislocated. Don't worry about it. Rest up and we'll finalize everything tomorrow night. You did it, I'm shocked. Me too. I just can't believe it. I mean, against all odds. I know. I'll definitely be sad to see you go. You've become one of my top guys. You'll be fine, though, right? I mean, you got Cole and the rest of the crew, yeah? Sorry. What, what am I doing? This is your time to celebrate, not to worry about me and BCW. You enjoy the moment. I'm going to go talk to Triple H about when you might start, so maybe I can get you on one more BCW show. We'll do a big farewell match. It'll be great. Sounds good. I... 
I'll see you back at the hotel. Congrats. I'm... I'm proud of you. Thanks, Baron. Couldn't have done it without you. Just a one-time thing, or are you signing with WWE? Autograph. Well, actually, I was literally just offered an NXT contract, and I can't wait to get started. You should just skip NXT and go straight to the main roster. Actually, you know what? Hey, Triple H, you say listen to your audience? Well, the audience is saying that I'm good enough to go straight to the main roster, which actually, I think I proved it tonight by going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down, but... <laughs> Yeah! Boom! Hey, stop! Oh. Damn! Oh.